Oh God, give me the strength. Give me the power. Give me the strength. Okay, what's going on, fashion friends? You know, on this journey that we go through called grinding and striving and success, we have to sometimes check out our greenery. We have to see all the things that are around us. We have to look through the forest and the trees and under the ground because we surround ourselves sometimes with people that we think are our friends, our loved ones. <laughs> oh, you're there for me. Oh, I'm there for you. Please, let me clock a T, a X, Y, and a Z on a more J Couture TV, baby, okay? So listen, I've compiled a list of five type of friends that really should be evaluated or better yet, even get the boot out of your life. The boop, 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 out of your life. Now, fashion friends, I started with number five. And this is that me, myself, and why type of friend. Every time you go through something or you have a problem or you want to express or vent or just get those demons out of you, it always goes right back around to that friend. And it's like, how do we get here? How do we get there? I thought that we were talking about, you know, my issue. Just, just, for, just for five minutes about my issue. Come on. Every time you want a cell phone and you open up your mouth, it goes right back to that friend. Have you ever noticed that? And it's like, every, any and everything that you talk about, it's like, how do we get back to this place? Can I have my moment? I've given you your moment in every conversation that we have, and, it, it, and at every conversation that I begin to open my mouth, or even begin to even speak the words of my problems, we get back to yours. I'm not understanding. It's that, give me, give me, give me, give it to me, give it to me, give me, give me, give me, type of friend. For an example, the girls are going out to go eat. And every time you turn around, oh, this girl, she don't, she don't want to buy nothing. She don't want to pay for nothing. But yeah, when them plates drop and that, and that food get dropped off to your table, give me some, give me some of that. Oh, oh let me try some of that. Oh, just, just give me a little piece. Oh, let me give a little piece of this. Oh. You said you weren't hungry, but now you want something to eat, you, you want to, you want to, no, what you want to do is you want to eat over everybody else's place and do your food. How about that? Or when you go out to, go out to the club, this girl no good and well that she don't got no money for the club, but yeah, when you get to the club, oh, I don't got no money, can you give me like $20 to get in? Ooh, $20? Or can you give me your RSVP to get inside the club? Ooh, my RSVP? So when were you going to tell me that you didn't have any coin or no money? Exactly. That my life, my life, my life, my life. When you look at my life, you see what I see. That friend that every time you ready to go out, it's a Friday night, it's a Wednesday drink night, the dance is going to be out, you ready to have a good time. You go over to that house and you call them up and what happens? My life is terrible. I'm ready to kill myself. Oh, nobody care about me. Nobody want me. I hate my job. I don't got no friends. I'm so tired. This is like, are, are you going to constantly keep singing that Mary J. Blige My Life Tour? I am so tired of you singing that song. Every time we talk about the song, I'm ready to blast my ears off. Because you keep singing my life and I'm sitting up here singing Destiny Child and woke up this morning and, and the sunshine is shining. Can I please have a happy moment with you? Why do you always act so depressed? What's going on, sugar? We done had the same conversation six times and you still keep singing the same old shoulda, coulda, woulda song. You been ready to kill yourself six times ago, six, six days ago, six hours ago. Can you please change the tune? Do you have any of those friends that every time you come around, it's just like, what is going Every time they open their mouth, is something sad and depressing. It's that weak and that insecure friend that you definitely want to look out for because that weak and insecure friend, see, those are the ones that can't look at themselves in the mirror. Those are the ones that don't see the value in, them, in themselves. Those are the ones that don't even see their worth. So when they don't see their worth, they don't see their worth in others, you know? So they'll, they'll backstab you, they'll, they'll lie to you, they'll cheat to you, they'll, they'll do all kinds of things to you because this person has no type of worth for themselves. 
This person can be really vindictive, they can be spiteful, they can be just hurtful by nature, you know, because they don't know who they are. So they're trying to go, they're trying to do anything and everything to find out who they are. And along, along the way, they're hurting so many people that honestly care about them. Watch out for the weak and insecure friend. See, that weak, insecure friend doesn't have a reflection. They don't see themselves in the mirror. They don't know who they are, you know. They look at you and they see great things, which is a good thing. But what they do is they want to take your stilo, your shine. Ooh, I know. Ooh, hallelujah. Oh, I'm gonna, ooh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna put back. I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna put back. I, I, I don't know. I'm confused. <laughs> it's coming to me. Oh, uh, it's that weak, insecure cool cunt. You gotta look out for him because that one right there will get you hemmed up. Number one, this friend baby especially for my dream chasers, for my ones that got things going on with their life. You gotta watch these friends, better yet, because this tone will constantly play in your life. That so good, so good, so good. I know you hate it, but I'm so good, so good, so good. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, I'm doing mighty fine. Last time I seen you, it's been a long time. Stop smiling, let me get that look off your face. Please don't even front, stop being so fake. That friend that every time they see you doing good, they start hating. They got negative things to say when you want to talk about a change in your life. Or when you want to talk about the good things that have happened to you. Or when you want to start talking about just the great, just the joy that you're feeling right now. You got those hating so good, so good, so good friends. They come along and want to destroy everything that you're trying to set up for yourself. Watch them. Oh, baby, you gotta watch them. Number one and number two, watch them. See, I can deal with Miss Gimme Gimme because all she gonna do is beg. I can, like, I can pay her. And I can deal with Miss Me, Myself, and Why because I don't have to call her. But Miss My Light, but Miss, um, <coughs> We Can Insecure, and Miss So Good, So Good, oh, they gotta go. Trust and believe me, you will want them to go real quick with no hesitation at all. Babies, I want you to evaluate the people that are around you, fashion friends, and ask yourselves, is, is this who you want to be around, or is this who you want to take to the next chapter in your life? Believe me, every friend that I've just named, I have exterminated. So fashion friends, evaluate your friends, evaluate the situations that you're going through with some of your friends, and ask yourselves, do you really want to be around some of them, or do you want to give these hoes a grace point? And a grace point is you're going to talk to them graciously for the last time. To give them a grace point. Do you deserve this grace that I give you? That's all.